Thank you. Come on, miss. Let's go. Thank you. Now that is a black girl worth doing. Why'd you do it, son? He was in my face. Oh, now there's a reason. No, it's because of how they are. How are they? You know. No, I don't. Tell me. They have no respect. They don't care about this country at all. All they do is sit on their butt and complain. And what do they have to complain about? It's because of them and their quotas that I'm not in the Ivy League, where I belong. Look, you all had quotas for centuries. You called them legacies, restricted country clubs, the law. Oh, hey, my grandfather came to this country with nothing. He couldn't even speak the language. But he worked hard, and he made a place for himself and his family. Now, why can't you people do the same? Hey, my grandfather built this country, man. He fought wars for it. And most places he went wouldn't let him sit down and get a cup of coffee. I can't even catch a cab in New York. You know, it doesn't matter how many degrees I get. All you people see is color. Your grandfather was an immigrant. You're American. My grandfather was born here, Duke. And you people still look at me as just another nigger. Riveting history lesson, oh, Professor. All right, just let him go. I say he's right. What did you say? I said he's right. I'm not at A&M because quotas kept me out of another school. I'm here because I always wanted to go here. You know, when I was growing up, I used to play all the time with black kids. I, mean, I never thought anything about it. Then one day, I must have been about nine, I was fishing with my dad and uncle. My dad told my uncle this joke. He said, what do you call a Negro physician from Virginia? A nigger. You know? I'd heard that word before, but never from my father. So he probably wouldn't have minded what we did today. But I'm ashamed. I'm sorry. Hey, man. I don't want your apology, but I, I want their arms broken. So I want to punish, man. And I want my car fixed now. You don't see your part in all this, do you? Well, I'm the victim. More brothers on the team. Well, that's just the truth. Oh, so you're comfortable with the stereotype that all black people can do is run. Hey, hey, look, we don't expect a fair shake from you, officer. That's right, I'm a white man. That's yeah. right. I could be a card carrying member of the clan. Never know. Boy. Oh, I could have marched with Dr. King. You don't know. Maybe you should look at me as an individual and not as a color. 